Penang is known to have some of the best street food in Asia. So what should we eat in Georgetown? In this video, the Penang Nights from Penang Culture Singapore brought us on a three-day food tour to show you how to eat like a local in Penang. Hello from Penang! It's our first day here and we are super hungry. So the first stop recommended by the owners from Penang Culture is Kopitiam along Jalan McAllister. They have Asam Laksa, Chicken Wing Satay, Popia. Let's go and dig it now! As you can see, we had lots of good food but my favourite was the Ping Nan Chi Chong Fan drizzled with lots of prawn paste and chilli sauce. Hong Kei Food Corner serves one of the best pork noodles that you can get in Penang. Mei Hyung Coffee Shop is another place where you can get lots of good food at night. Let me tell you a secret. Our aim for this trip was to find the best lomi in Penang. This bowl of lomi in Meihyong Coffee Shop, mm, not too bad. Well, let's see what happens tomorrow. Even though we were already very full, but that didn't stop me from buying my favourite mi jam kue with lots of peanuts and sweet corn. We ended the night with Lime Clear Nasi Kanda, this food store in the back alley that sells superb curry rice. Good morning from Maoski Market! This is a great spot for breakfast and our first stop will be Hemi! I'm still very full from last night's dinner but that didn't stop me from trying the delicious Hokkien Mee in Mao Erskine. The spicy and flavorful broth is served with shrimps, slices of pork, bean sprouts and noodles. Very flavorful and shook. Remember our quest to find the best lor mee in Penang? After our breakfast, we head straight to Akui Street Lor Mee. The gravy was thick and robust, mm, but a little salty for me. Now I'm curious, what are the differences between Singapore lor mee and Penang lor mee? Singapore is used black vinegar, ours is used white vinegar. And maybe here it's more fragrant because of the usiang fen. Singapore usiang fen is different. With a never give up attitude, we head to the third lor mee store at Kedai Kopi Sing Tor. Oh man, this is impressive. That sticky gravy looks unassuming but has a balance of savoury, sour, sweet and spicy flavours. When you are at a coffee shop, you can also try the fried kuei tiao. Speaking of Penang cha kuei tiao, do you have a favourite? Uh, I like my Penang cha kuei tiao, smoky with dark egg. Every time I come to Penang, I will sure go to Aling famous cha kuei tiao. Thanks to Sean, Aling Cha Kui Tiao is definitely one of the better ones. We recommend going for the one with duck egg. Ayo, one plate is not enough! To escape the heat, we head to Project Nasi Lomak which is the talk of the town in Penang. The cheese baked lobster is served with nasi lomak and dyed blue with butterfly pea flour. Their homemade sambal was memorable. Which reminds me of Tuapui Kari Mi, a generous bowl of curry noodles with tau pork, coagulated blood, cockles and more. The soup is enhanced with several types of curry, giving it a little more complexity. It's spicy but shook leh. Now I just need fresh coconut water from Anba to complete my lunch. So tea break is seafood popia at Padang Brown, which is one of the oldest store in Penang. They have crab meat in their popia and it's drowned in stir fried turnip gravy.
while waiting for dinner, we head to the roadside store for pisang goreng and fried nian gao. Wow, I'm really very full. But guess what? Sean saved the best for the last. So my last meal for the day is dark kway teow teng in Pulau Tikus. This is the epitome of comfort food on a rainy day. Oh, this is it. I need my bed. I've been to Penang a few times and Pulau Tikus Market is one of my favourite breakfast spots. On our last day, we are back here for Cha Kwe Kak and A Tui Mi Sua. is dressed in mala sauce, pork lard, soy sauce and sesame oil. Mmm, yums! With that, I conclude my Penang trip. Thank you to the team from Penang Culture for showing us around. I look forward to trying their version of Lor Mee back in Singapore. For more information about the eateries we have visited in Penang, please visit www.mistamjak.com. See you there! Bye!